Hello, in today's video, we will go through the process of accessing SCP HANA models and data from SCP BW by using the SCP Composite Provider. And as you may know, the SCP Composite Provider uh, can combine the analytics index and the uh, in memory cube together. So, in that way, we can combine both the data from SCP-BW and SCP-HORNA. All right? So in order to do that, we will first to um, find an a analytic view or calculation view. We will use, uh, we will access from the SCP-BW. And then we will create the uh, analytic index based on the SCP model. And after that, we will create a SCP Composite Provider to combine both the analytic index and the SCP BWQ. And finally, we will create a SCP Bex query based on the Composite Provider. All right. So let's first to check the analytic view we're going to use. Okay. So we will use the uh, VBAP, this is a very simple analytic view as you can see from my screen. So it's just be created based on the table VBAP. And you know, I just made a, a few changes like we uh, created a uh, calculated column, we call it year. All right. And finally, you will see these output columns. Okay. So then the next step, we will create an analytic index. Right. So in order to do that, I have to log on to the BW704 on HANA. Okay. Before we start, uh, we just first check this. Uh, um, let's, oh, oh, sorry. I need to run it again. All right. So we need to first have a look at this uh, data. Okay, this is uh, SCP Netware Zone dot four, and with the uh, uh, BW support package two. Okay, so okay, so now we have to create the analytic index based on the HANA model uh, VDAP. So in order to do that, I have to run the transaction RS BD and for exam and for public. So here you can choose the package and then you can choose the analytic view. Okay, VBAP. Just simply already been part of the second delete. And then click again, right? So I'll give the analytic index name that VBAP. Uh, so here you see some uh, info objects. You can simply give the mapping between the uh, HANA view field and the BW uh, info object, right? I create some customized uh, uh, info objects so that we can use to simply map the HANA field. It's just direct mapping. And then you can click save and check everything is fine. So we leave it. So also we need to find another ICP BWQ because in the company provider we want to combine both the data from HORNA and ICP BW, right? So that's RC1. And I find this here we have the field of the queue. Um I have some data here. Okay, all right, I can simply create data. Okay, we have some data here. And uh, keep in mind that we have the data in uh, calendar year 2013, 14, and 15. Okay, because we want to compare between the data from the SVB cube and the HORNA. And as you will see later, uh, the HORNA only contains data before uh, calendar year 2013. Okay. So 
I still go back to RC1 and I right click and you have the option to create the complete provider and I'll give it a name. All right. So this is the main screen. You're going to create the uh, complete provider and on the left panel, you will see the analytic, analytic index. You just create it based on the HANA analytic view. And also you will see this cube, all right? So our target is to combine both this uh, analytic index and this cube together, all right? So in order to do that, you can simply drag and drop this uh, analytic index and choose the binding type of the unit. And then I can drag this cube unit two. And here we can choose which fields we want to put in this uh, composite provider. Okay. So in our case, we only want to see the cube, uh, the fields, quantity, plant, and uh, material, material here. All right. You can add select fields. Uh, you will map the same fields from the HANA model. All right. So this is the uh, quantity. So let's see. This is the calendar year. Material and plant. Also, I have to put this uh, unit because you know uh, the VW has the you know uh, key figure has the unit. So I have to do the same. So, so far we just simply created the uh, company provider based on the SCP HANA model and SCP BWQ. Okay, we can simply save and activate. Yeah, you can see everything is green. So I think everything is fine. Okay, so here is the uh, text name of the uh, uh, SCP company provider. We can run transaction to save the data. Yeah. Okay, I made a mistake. I want to choose two different key figures. I want to compile the key figures between SCP BWQ and SCP HANA, right? So, I'll give two different names. This is a BW twenty, right? Is a Horner twenty. So we have two key figures. One is from BW, we call it BW Quantity, and the other is from SCP HANA, so we call it HANA Quantity. So later we will compile these two key figures. Here we see the data, right? Uh, as you can see here, we have data from 2013. We only have data from BW Quantity, okay? And for the data be before uh, 2013, like 2012, 2010, you only see, I can simply, I think, 2010, 2012, you only have the data. I need the, the key figure, HANA quantity, right? So that means these records are from the HANA, and these records are from the BW. And uh, let's have a quick look at the HANA models. Make sure only have data from 2010 and 2012, right? So to that, right click, data preview, go to raw data, see the calendar year, 
you only have the year 2012, right? So in, you don't have the data in HANA in 2013, 2014, 2015. All data, all the data for 2013, 14, 15 are actually from the ICPBWQ. So you can simply right click that is data, oh, sorry, display data. And then we choose calendar year. That's enough. See here in the queue, we have the data for 2013, 14, 15. Right? That means these two key figures here we see just reflect the, the data from two different data provide one from SVB Horner model and Lexi View, and the other is from SVB BW, right? So finally, we can create a SVB back query based on the competitive provider to analyze the data. I click new and you see the uh, company provider, and we just simply drag and drop the calendar year and client here, and then we drop two key figures here. And we can choose save and just give a simple name. And we can run this back query. Hey, as you can see, we have data, right? So in the year 2010-2012, you only have the data uh, in the IPB Horn funded, right? So uh, sorry, I can do one more thing. I want to see all the results. Uh, right. So I just provide all the results. So I don't want to see that. So as you can see here, it's pretty clear. For 2000, for year 2010, 2012, you only have the key figure. Uh, in Harna pointed because we only have data in Harna for those two years. And for the year 2013, 14, 15, we only have values in the key figure BW pointed because we only have this in ICB BW query. And if we want to combine those two key figures, we can simply drag, remove the candy from the, uh, from the drill down. So you will see all these key figures sum. So you can simply create another formula, you know, to, um, to uh, get a sum of these two key figures, okay? And this is, you know, a very quick demo about how to access SVP HANA models and data from SVPW by using SVPW company provider, right? Thanks for watching.